what's up guys you're welcome back to my channel in today's video i'll show you how to make this denim wrap skirt so let's get started first you fold your fabric into two places with the right sides facing each other and then you take the length of your skirt so for mine i'm using 28 inches so i'll remove two inches for the waistband and then i have 28 and then add two inches for seam allowance so i have 30 inch 30 inches so i'm cutting the back first and then next i'll come here i'll use here as my base i'll take my waist measurement so i have waist measurement divided by four so i have eight and a half so you divide your waist measurement by four and then you add two inches for seam allowance and then you come down here by eight inches to take the hip measurement you can also use nine inches so you divide your hip measurement by four mine is ten and a half and then i add two inches for seam allowance and then i'm just going to draw the hip line down to the end of the skirt and then take the waistline connected to the hip line and then cut so here's the back part to mark the dots you just come over here and then you take four inches you can use four inches you can use four and a half or you can use five and then you come down by five inches and then i'll take half an inch on each side so i'll take half an inch here and take half an inch here and then just slide it down and then mark it on the other side too Cut the front, you fold your fabric again into two places and you fold it a, a bit bigger and then you place the back bodies or the back panel on the front panel, leaving at least five inches on this side for the overlap and then you cut, you cut on this side. So you take the front panel, you come over to the bottom, you mark five inches. And then you come over to the top, you mark two inches. And then you take your ruler, you just rule a slant line down to this place. And then you cut across the line. So here is the front panel. You come over to the top part and you measure the five inches extra. And then you notch it on both sides. And then to cut the pocket, you come over to the side. You take three inches on this side. And seven inches on this side and then you just draw a slant line like so and then you cut across the slant line I've cut this four pieces of 
11 inches wide and eight and a half inches long. So I cut four, four pieces of it. So for these two, I'll use this as my inner turning or whatever it's called. And then I'll just cut, I have the right sides facing each other. I'll just cut it. And then I'll go over to my sewing machine. I'll fix the pockets. After fixing the pockets, you go ahead and hold your dart on the back side. And then you, you go ahead and join the sides of the skirt together. So after joining the sides of the dress, you go ahead and hem the edge of the, of the skirt. You do it on both sides. Next thing is to mark where you're going to place your button. So I have the, I want the right side to be on the top. So here's the left part and here's the right part. So I'm going to mark, join the notched part together and then mark, mark it here. So I'm going to mark this place for the button, the inner button. So I'll mark it. And then the other button is going to be on the edge of this one. So next you go ahead and measure your waist, the entire waistline. For mine, I have 22 inches. And then you cut your waistband. I've cut mine, I have 23. I added one inch for seam allowance. And then I cut six inches wide because I'm going to be folding it into three like this for the waistband. So we'll have a thicker waistband. So you take your waistband, you take the right side and you place it on the wrong side of the skirt. And then you sew, you go ahead and sew it together. You leave the half an inch on this side. You go ahead and sew the entire waistline. So after sewing the waistband to the skirt, you go ahead and sew the edges together. And then you flip it to the right side. I notch this part. And then you flip it to the right side. And then you sew it. You go ahead and sew it. After fixing your waistband, you go ahead and sew the buttons. So you sew the big button on the left side and then the button hole on the right side. And then you go ahead and sew a smaller button inside on the right side. And then you sew the button hole on the left side. So it's going to be like this. And then like this. Lastly, you go ahead and hem the bottom. For mine, I'll be using the seam ripper to shred it because I want the bottom to be frail. And that's it. So here's the denim wrap skirt. Please give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel. I love you for watching. Thank you.